Welcome back to Improvision Entertainment. My name is Hunter Munn. This is Papers, Please, but it's not just Papers, Please. You may be at the start of a playlist that is going for a particular achievement. Which achievement it is, I don't know, because this actually video can be at the start of two different playlists. Because the beginning of a run is uh, of these two runs are the same. These runs are Member of the Order, which is going for basically all of the Ezek things I can do, the S the supposedly terrorist, but actually freedom fighters, nationalist group that's inside of Aristotska. And for the records, if you are watching this first and you haven't seen the original run through, I recommend you go watch the original run through because I actually do try and keep up with the story and the characters and what's going on, and I make mistakes and it's entertaining and all that stuff. But otherwise, we are here for achievements, and one of the ways of getting achievements in most games is to tick on easy mode, as you can see over here to the side. Now. What's important to note about Easy Mode in Papers, Please is that it doesn't make the game easier. I mean, it sort of does, because what it does is at the end of the day, when you get your payout for what you've done, you get like an additional 20 bucks. But otherwise, all the paper checking and all of the documents coming in and everything that you need to do, all that stuff is identical and is not easier. And it doesn't roll that it makes it easier and it doesn't make it so you have to check less things. All it does is give you a little extra cash at the end of the day. And part of the reason that we're doing this is because we want to go for a Class 5 apartment, okay? I don't even know the game had Class 5 apartments, but that's one of the achievements that we're aiming for. And some other things along the way. I'm not going to go into all the details until they're actually relevant, so at the beginning of this playthrough, that's what we're doing. Now, this recording is going to be the first four days, and one of the things I'm going to be doing differently that I haven't done previously, if I have done this correctly, is I'm going to turn on this. This information that you see below me, I have grabbed from the paperspleasefandom.com wiki, okay? And what it will allow you to do is to call out to me, if you want, uh, some of the information that is uh, relevant to the day I'm on. In this case, what should be displaying for you is day number one. And I'll have to update this every single day, so it'll take a little copy and paste, add a little bit of time between the days, but I'll do that while the... Um, uh, the end of the day screen or newspaper stuff is up. Otherwise, I don't think there's any reason to not keep going what we're doing. So, we are going to be creating a new story path way back here. Way, way back here. Continue to write most save or delete a branch to free up track. Okay. So, we will be deleting this branch that we got for the um, bad things happen to our family ending. We will be creating a new game. Oh, and I will be clicking to make sure I can see my chat. Congratulations. The October Leader Lottery is complete. Your name was pulled. Placement in the Ministry of Missions at the Gresson Borg Checkpoint, which is on the border between East and West Gresson. The apartment will be provided to you and your family in East Gresson. Expect a Class 8 dwelling. Remember, we have to get up to Class 5 to get for an achievement. Glory to Astatska. Rest and board checkpoint open at last, families to reunite. Now this shit's real easy on the first day. Um Alright, double checking my notes that are actually in the screen that you can see. Huh, okay. So, welcome to your new position at the Grest and Border Checkpoint. Um, stamp passport, entry visa, and return document to entrant entrant is only restricted to Estos and citizens only. Deny all foreigners. So, that's pretty straightforward. We'll put this away. We'll bring this up in case we need a foreigner thing. Now, one of the things I didn't realize when I was playing through the game originally is that you can actually just straight up deny people. Until you get the little a reason stamp, you don't actually have a give, give a reason to deny people. So... Oh, and I'll have no upgrades. Crap. Aristotskin. Uh, expiration date is in time. As far as I know, the rest of that looks right. Might not have been correct issuing city or something. But we're allowed two mistakes, and we're going to take all of those mistakes where we can. Just to speed things up. Lady is in poor, so I should be able to just deny her without saying why. I don't have an inspect thing. Aristotskin cities only. Peppa's Plus, Republia, again, no, here you go. Our Stutzens only, 
Unbelievable. Go to hell. Yeah, my dude. Get in here. Papers, please. Kalechia. There you go. I'm gonna take this breather time to just do the game because I'm not being asked complicated things yet. This checkpoint was a mistake. Dude leaves anyway. He increments my timer. That's perfectly fine. Or my counter, I should say, right down here. Papers Plus. Uh, 1023 West Greston, Kalechia. I keep trying to hit tab to open up the thing, but it doesn't do that. Next, please. Papers Plus. Import. Nope. Airsoftskins only. Lady Papers, please. Um, 11, 19, 11, 19. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that's 83. I guess nobody's, like, invalid on the first day. I don't think I can get tickets on the first day, actually. Well, I can if I let somebody in who shouldn't get in. Airstatskins only. Moving on. Oh my dude. Impor. Yep, no. Our Statskins only. Our Statskins. Papers plus. Our Statskin. I can't tell any way that your stuff is wrong. There's nothing to correlate. Papers please. Our Statskin. 484, you look like your picture. That's really the stuff that matters right now. And again, I'm allowed two mistakes, so we're just going to let this slide. I think it's the beginning of the game. We're not really in danger. Aristotelian, 84. You look like your picture. I don't have a way to tell if your timer is wrong. Hey, what the heck? That person was walking into the gate and then decided not to. Energy expenses usually the day below. Okay, so easy mode crutch. That's the only difference between this difficulty level and the next difficulty level, is that that says easy mode crutch. That, to my knowledge, is it. That's the only difference. So, having said that, uh, we are going on to day number two, and this will be a longer recording for those of you who are watching on YouTube. Now, part of that longer recording is that I'm going to be switching out these day things. So, Hopefully, on the screen, when I turn this off and turn it back on, it will now be for day number two. And I'm going to double check it really quick. First entrant has a valid ID. That's cool. Second has an expired. Duh, duh, duh. Okay, so that's all I'm really going to look at, but you guys can see it. That's mostly for you and not for me. But So I can allow and deny, and why not? We're going for achievements, right? So we just, we'll just pay attention to stuff. Nothing super different will happen until, like, day number four. Make sure I can see the chat. Let me know, chat, if this is entertaining to you, because if it's not, I could be talked into playing a different game right now. But I saw that the achievements in, in Papers, Please were achievable, so I will be achieving them if possible. From today forward, we got to have a valid passport and permit to enter. Boost inspection hardware is now installed. Check for discrepancies. Okay. So, foreigners need a valid entry permit, and all documents must be and must be current. <laughs> I, I can't actually see that window I was looking at. So, first entrant is valid, second entrant, expired passport. Okay. That's what we're going with. We're not even going to look. We're going to hope the wiki is right. Let's see if we trust the wiki. Wait, hold on. Oh, just valid passport. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna give this to you. And I'm gonna deny the second person because their shit's gonna be out of date. Uh, it is out of date. I see that. You are denied. Cool. And that's as far as I'm looking ahead, honestly. Now we'll do the actual for realsies. 
Impor, I can't tell that that number isn't correct. Female, as far as I can tell, though that, though you, oh shit. Uh, eh, er, er. Discrepancy, you're not, you don't look like this picture. It is an old picture. I'm not going to risk it. Here, go. I have a reason. Later, I'll be able to fingerprint you, but not right now. Papers plus. Uh, 83, Vondor, female, da da da, Mira. I didn't actually listen to what you said, but seems right. We're allowed two mistakes. We will take our two mistakes. Tell me how I'm wrong. Nope, I was not wrong. Cool. Uh, 83, Overvich, male. Overvich, Vondor, Aristotska, yeah. Now it's important that we have that easy mode on because it'll make doing certain stuff with money later easier. And again, we're going for achievements. And for you guys to see further endings. That doesn't... It looks like your eyes are closed there. Okay. 83, Paradisia. Date of birth. I don't have enough information to know any of that is wrong. Oh, you know what? I just re remembered. Anybody who gives me that little sticker... Um... They are valid. I saw that in the wiki. Every single one of them has a valid entry permit. Enkyo from Impor South. Right? Oh, alright. Day is short. Alright, well, that's, that's bad for that guard. He was cut short by a terrorist attack. Progress is saved at the start of each day. Alright. We're going to do a little bit of juggling here. We're going to turn off food and heat opposite days. And that should allow us to save some money. So we're going to be getting a lot of money. Um, oh. I need to change the day thing. This one's probably going to scroll off the screen. But it'll be fine. You don't you don't need the whole thing. Oh wow, I have to click on so many things right now. So if I save this, turn this off, turn it back on, it should be for day number three. What do I need to know about day number three? Anything super specific? First Valid papers, second, fails to present a ticket, but will in interrogation, so valid, valid. Valid, valid, valid. Okay. So, continuing on. Like I said in this first recording, we're going to go to day number four. It's going to be a little bit longer for anybody watching on YouTube. Okay. So require an entry permit today. I have to call for entry permits, so... Okay, so you are valid, so says the wiki. Now you are invalid, because you require an entry ticket, but you don't have it. But then you say you do have it, and then I stamp you approved anyway, because the wiki tells me to, and we're going to go with the wiki until it's wrong. <laughs> Alright. Entry person number three gives me the, um, the ladies' nightclub thing, which means that she has a valid entry permit. I don't know, it's video games, that's how this works. And now we're going to start paying attention to everybody else. That guy kind of looks like a Slim Yuri. Uh, that looks like you. Okay. Oh, 125, which is today. Savisigiri. As far as I know, that all looks right. 983, yep. You look like your picture. Let's see if I'm wrong. I am wrong. Invalid issuing city. Alright, well, we're going to take our one citation and keep moving. There is a special thing you can get on one day for not having, um... 
glory in Antiagra for not having any citations, and uh, that sounds horrible and near impossible, so we're not going for it. It's not an achievement, to be clear. That is not today's date. Oh? Yeah, oh. Oh man, this game is so easy in the beginning. Eleven twenty-five is today. Eighty-four. I think the game's gonna make me question whether you're a woman or not. As document says. Sorry, it's gonna make me question that. Get out. I can't check it. Oh, hi, Yuri. I mean, Georgie. I'm sorry. I've been saying your name wrong for hours. Um. Ashkoskin is great. Does not require a passport, right? Passport is required. Okay, okay, I hear you. I come back again. Yeah, yeah. GTFO, my dude. Uh, Yuri is actually related to a achievement, um, uh, uh, an emblem we will be going for. Uh, give me a ticket. What? Ah. Wait, what? Oh, you're Aristotskin. What am I saying? Uh, I question your maleness. I question your masculinity. Alright. Looks right to me. Why was I wrong? Man. Non matching photo. What? Really? Well, wow. look at me slacking. 1125, date of birth. Oh! 1125, it's your birthday. Congrats! Um, that looks like you. Okay, I was about to be very rusty at the game. I'll understand. One eleven twenty-five. This is expired. This document has expired. What mistake? I just renewed it. Yeah, no. Papers, please. Uh, Aristotskin, 84, male. I mean, I think it looks like you, but sometimes the game is like, that's not the person, so, alright. I was wrong some other way. No, I wasn't. Cool. Papers, please. Please, papers. 1125, cool. 83 over here, male, vendor, da da da, Kaleshkia. I'm not checking issuing cities. I should at this point because I have citations. Papers, please. Uh, that is not the correct date. Oh, I don't have to do this. I just realized I don't ever have to do that at the beginning of the game. I can just deny it because the date's wrong. I don't have to spend the time inspecting. 1125. Uh, you look like your picture to me. Issuing city was wrong. Six, am I at 16 people? No, I'm at 15 people. 1125. NQ is correct. Is mail correct? No one knows. Nobody knows the difference. Password is correct. I don't think the game allows me to believe you. Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Okay, I have made an executive decision. Okay, so everybody is hungry, but they are not cold. Will we be paying for the medicine? So instead what I'm going to do is I'm going to split it up for doing the first three days on this first run for 20 minutes here on YouTube 
and I'm going to do sets of two days going forward because I think that's everybody wants shorter viewing time. So, um, on that note, I thank you for watching. This has been Improvision Entertainment Presents Papers, Please. I've been Hunter Munn, and I will see you in the future.